Yeah, I'm standing next to a very beautiful tropical conifer, Decridium balance, from New Caledonia. And uh, this is, it actually looks a lot like our Norfolk Island pines and the cook pines that are grown around South Florida. But it's actually in a whole different family, the Podocarpus family, Podocarpaceae. But it doesn't, uh, looks a lot different than its close relatives. And uh, this plant comes from this island of New Caledonia where it's kind of a lost world for tropical conifers with nearly 50 species only found on that island the size of New Jersey. And many of them like our climate here in South Florida. So we're, they make uh, surprisingly good landscape plants. And this plant was uh, in our garden was a result of a long-term collaboration between three different gardens. It came originally to the uh, University of California Santa Cruz Arboretum uh, about 40 years ago. And uh, we collected cuttings uh, about a decade ago and the Atlanta Botanical Garden helped us to propagate them and then we got it from them. So it went to, uh, from the Pacific to two different botanic gardens and then to Fairchild and it's uh, thriving in the garden. This is a female, um, even though we, we think of conifers as having cones we recognize easily. This, um, the female cones, on this are actually very tiny. Uh, they look almost like a new shoot. They're, they're very hard to recognize, um, but they are technically cones. So uh, not all cones look like cones. And, uh, and the Arcarias, its close relatives that, that look a lot like this, do have cones that look, look more like cones. So uh, oftentimes in the plant world, it's the reproductive structures that tell us the story of what, what things are related to. And this is definitely the case with this very unusual tropical conifer.